you have to explain how. In other words, you, you've got to give credibility to how. Like, in other words, the reason why they're able to create these profitable breakout strategies in 14 days or less. What is the reason why? Right? So you can't just dangle out the claim and not back it up with how. And I don't mean, you don't have to go into a detailed, uh, a detailed description. You don't have to get into the nitty gritty details, right? Like if you were selling a supplement for bringing down cholesterol, let's just say, you don't have to get into the anatomy and physiology behind, um, you know, every piece of this supplement, but you have to give some indication of how it works, right? Like even if you just said, right, th like the reason why, the reason why this supplement, you know, the reason why XYZ works to bring down your cholesterol is because of how it controls and regulates your own body's production of HDL, LDL, whatever, right? Like that even itself can be, can be enough but you have to give them something to hang their hat on other than just a claim that you can do it, right? So always, you heard me say, you've heard me say this before and I cannot stress this enough. If you really want, I did a, a, a I think it's, it's posted on our Facebook, our private Facebook group. It's also on the Todd Brown Marketing Facebook page. I did like a 30 minute live, a Facebook live, um, the other day, and I talked about this exact thing that today, and let me tell you that, let me take a step back for, for one second. So the other day I did an interview with, um, I did an interview with Jeremy Blossom. He's in our top one mastermind. He started a brand new podcast. He asked me to be the first guest on the podcast. He is a wicked smart, wicked savvy kid. He's in the financial world. He's got an ad network that he runs. He's got, a, you know, a, a, a financial publishing site, like it's wicked, wicked smart kid. He was actually ironically on, I believe, MTV Road Rules years ago, I think it was. Um, and so if you search his name, you'll, you'll, you'll see him on there. Road Rules, Real World, I don't know, one of those things. Uh, and he asked me, he said on the podcast, he said, like, what is the most, what's one of the most valuable things that, uh, that, you know, you've learned that you feel, you know, marketers, entrepreneurs need to understand today in 2019. That Facebook Live on that Facebook Live, I shared exactly what it is that I told Jeremy on his podcast. And, and you've heard me kind of allude to it before, and that is you have to, have to tell your prospects today how and why your product or service is delivering or can deliver the results that you're promising it will deliver. That's what more, more and more of your prospects, the overwhelming majority, they want to know that. They get excited by the idea. Yes, they love, yes, they need to know what your product or service will do for them, right? They need to know, but they want to know how, 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 like, how is this, how is this possible? How, like, right? Because if, if, if I don't know how I've got nothing to hang my hat on, not only that, but I don't know what this consists of. Is this a, right? Like what, am I going to learn coding? Am I going to learn a formula? Is this going to be a cheat sheet that I'm going to get? Like, how is this delivered? Help me to, to, to not only know how this is delivered, right? But Help me to see that I can do it. Help me to understand why the how works, right? And so you got you to gotta have that in here. And really, it's, it's the part that, 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 uh, that's missing because it's really what comes in between here. So you kind of introduce this. Imagine if you could uncover the, the, the how to build breakout strategies fast, 14 days, da, 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 sounds too good to be true. And then it's like you go into the... Um, you go into the offer, but what you have to do in between here and the offer, Thomas, is you have to build the case for, like, it's almost like, almost sounds too, too good to be true, right? Well, it's not, and here's why, right? And then that's where you, you, you explain, um, uh, um, right, Here, here's why, because over the last whatever it is, over the last 12 months with the help of NASA scientists and medical doctors and Warren Buffett, we created an algorithm that allows you to blah, 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 blah. And the way it works is LMNOP. And because of that, any trader that uses this can create winning trades in a matter of 
of days. In fact, take a look at what Bob said, who had never created a breakout tra uh, uh, um, uh, trading strategy before after using this simple algorithm, right? So you've got to give them some meat to how it's done. And then after you've convinced them of the meat that you've got the answer to this, that's when you say, right? Uh, that's when you say, and that's why we put together this special package that I want to give you today, right? And when you join the, 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 the four, 14 day breakout challenge, right? Here's what you get. And then you go through the, um, the offer, but you got to give them Thomas, the, that, that middle chunk in between here and here. It's not enough anymore for all of you. It's not enough to simply make a claim and then give them testimonials or case studies and nothing to hang their hat on. You got to tell them how it works. And so other than that though, Thomas, uh, I really, I, I think that you've done a great job with this. I'm, I'm super excited, you know, especially for your first crack at this, um, like this, this is good. I'm, 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 I'm excited for you. Uh, and it was interesting because, you know, when I saw the, the, the price point, always make sure also when you give in dollar, in US dollar, that you put the dollar symbol, right? So that they know you're talking about um, currency, for certainly folks in this country. Um, but I expected it to be more. And so, uh, so but I'm, I'm excited for you. Well done, buddy. Yeah, uh, really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really good stuff. And so, all right, let's go on to the next critique. The next critique is an interesting one. This is from Michael. We're all familiar with, uh, you know, for, with what Michael has done, you know, uh, working with uh, Russian children who uh, have conditions and they normally would not get the medical care that they need in Russia. Uh, but uh, Michael, this charity that Michael, uh, the, the, the charity, really helps these kids get the medical treatment that they need in the United States uh, that they ordinarily wouldn't need. So uh, Michael said, uh, would like feedback on a campaign Global Giving approved us for on their crowdfunding uh, platform. We're limited to 500 characters for all the sections, no bolding or grouping of text either. Campaign launches on June 10th. So Michael, I'll, I'll give you a, a little bit of feedback, but I want to be crystal clear, right? The, the experience on a crowdfunding site, the is very different from, you know, just buying media and, uh, and driving to a web page, there's obviously a very different uh, mindset when you're uh, when you're on a page like this. And so, while I do have experience with uh, with uh, movies, like Christian-based movies, using crowdfunding, uh, this is definitely not my area of expertise. But uh, I had a chance to watch the video and I, I like it. I like the title over here. Interestingly enough, I did not like or do not like the, um, the first sentence. I just think it, it can be clear. I would almost even take this sentence and, uh, and make it the first sentence over here. Uh, I'm not even going to comment on the 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 other stuff, because like I said, this is definitely not my area of expertise, a crowdfunding page like this. But I like, and I want everybody to, to, to see this, even, with the, even in the first sentence, even the way the first sentence is written, what I want you to notice, and Michael did this, this is savvy, right? And you see this from the, the multi-step page that Michael's been working on, that the game when it comes to, you know, to, to these donation pitches, if you will, is it's two things. It's certainly focusing, it's focusing on the impact and focusing on the, the, how the giving impacts the giver, right? How it positions them, how it makes them feel. It is really, uh, it is really about, it's really about the deeper emotional desire for status and for significance in terms of the psychology of the giver as well as the impact. And so let's just take a look at this, uh, this section right here. Today you can help a child without ears to, um, to hear. 
uh, like I said, I didn't really, without ears to hear, I had to read it a couple times to fully comprehend. And then I scrolled up, saw this. And, uh, and then obviously it clicked. And so, uh, but every day in Russia, a baby is born without an ear, often with no ears. Um, this child is destined to live in a world of silence. Parents feel scared, helpless until they learn about American surgeons who create inner ear canals and outer ears uh, where none exist. Uh, and then a child can hear. It's a miracle. But for the parents, the cost of ear surgery plus travel to the U.S. is staggering. Help bring a child to America and give them the gift of, uh, of hearing. So what I, and th I wanted to, to, to point out one other thing here. Uh, where was it? The child is in the uh, uh, parents are scared, helpless until they learn about and, and then a child can hear. Oh, so back up for one second. So over here, uh, every day in Russia, uh, a baby is born without an ear, often with no ears. So the question, Michael, that I have for you is, were you intentionally trying to keep that singular? Like, I would have to imagine that there's more than one baby born per day in Russia that doesn't have uh, uh, in, you know, doesn't have an ear or ears, right? I would have to imagine that it's more than just one. The, the, because the reason why I say that is the way that this reads, it doesn't seem like an overwhelming problem, right? Like in other words, you're saying every day in Russia, a baby is born without an ear, often with no ears. That to me, the way it's written, it sounds like it's one, one baby, right, is born. The reality is every day in Russia, babies, right, babies are born, uh, uh, multiple babies. Uh, it could be dozens. It could be hundreds. I, I don't know what the number is, right, but it's certainly not a baby is born every day because that, that, to me, that doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't sound like, it doesn't feel like, even though, look, a baby born every day, anywhere without hearing, without an ear, that's a problem, period. But it doesn't read like it is a massive problem. And so, um, and so every day in Russia, babies are born, multiple babies are born, um, either without, without, uh, without an ear or without ears. Uh, these children are destined to live in a world of silence. And so I would just, you, you want to, when you're talking about the problem, you want to magnify the problem. You don't want to diminish the problem. You always want to, you know, it's, it is, you know, like I've said before, and you know, it's all in framing, right? Like a different frame uh, can have a radically different impact. You heard me talk about before, you can state the same thing two different ways and have two completely different um, impacts on people. If you said, you know, the, remember the example that I gave you guys and gals, the example of the doctor who talks to the patient and the patient asks, what's the, you know, what's the, um, what's the success rate? And the doctor says something like, you know, 20% of patients die on the table, right? Uh, that sounds horrible. Right. And then the, another patient asked the doctor, what's the success rate? And the doctor says 80% of patients are fine within four hours. Same exact statistic, same exact number, totally different frame, totally different impact. And so, uh, so that was the only thing that, um, that I would, uh, I would tweak here. I know I'm assuming Michael from your submission that you can only keep this to 500. And so it, it is a, it's certainly, um, it's certainly a little tough, but, uh, like I said, I don't have a huge, I don't have a huge amount of, uh, expertise in this area with these bad boys, but I'm excited to see how you do with this.